Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I, I changed my shirt up. If you want to see the, how I did this look, I did a morning breakfast and morning makeup and did the whole look. Um, I'm really quite pleased with it. It's kind of understated yet cute. Okay. I had to toot my own horn. Y'all know how I am because I'm full of myself. I'm full of myself. You're full of yourself. You're full of yourself. You know that song. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. Okay, that's what I was doing. <laughs> All right. So, many people do know by July. Well, in Lulu fashion and Coco fashion, we've done a high by July. I don't know. It kind of got out of control and everything. And we were talking about it. And I said, why don't we collab and just show all the things, you know, uh, well, we're not going to show everything. We're going to show as much as we can. Um, and do a collab. But the way we're doing this collab is we're doing premieres. So you're going to see a premiere from me right now. And then right after this premiere, Coco's premiere will start right behind mine. Um, so like mine will start at, I think, going for like nine. My time, I, I don't know the time. But whatever time I start, hers is going to be on the 30. Because what we said was we cannot go more than 30 minutes for this. So, um, we're going to go and do collabs like this. So, this is our first collab. You know, we do Makeup Mondays. But this is our first video collab. And what fun, because we are some shoppers. So, we're going to share our July shopping as much as we can in 25 minutes. Okay, so let's talk about the shopping issues that happen so here's the way we're going to do this i am going to show as much as i can about what i bought in july because there was a lot of shopping there was clothes there was shoes purses all kinds of stuff wound up being bought it at first i was doing okay i was buying clothes because i was going out of town and you know you go out of town and for some reason even though we're going to be around people that don't know us and have never seen us more than likely, we feel the need to buy new clothes, a couple of outfits or something. So I felt that need and I bought some shoes and everything, found some good deals. So that's what happened. So let me stop talking so we can get to the haul itself. So I'm going to start with some stuff that just came in, the stuff that I have that's the latest stuff. And then I'll start pulling older things from July as much as possible and I'm going to be watching my time to make sure that I stay within our time frame so let's go all right so lipstick day took me out I lost my lipstick wearing mine as if I needed more lipstick but that was just a catalyst for me to shop just being real so I got some stuff from Milani they gave a bunch of free stuff so I got this cute little bag this cute little uh uh, cosmetic bag because you can never have too many cosmetic bags apparently by these companies because they feel like giving us some all the time and I'm okay with it so I got um, they had lipsticks lip products buy two get one free so I had to buy and they have this new line called new fetish which I have one of them on my lips right now and I am living for them Okay, so the first thing I did was I got these. I got all six of them. So I have these. I'm not going to open them up now. I am going to swatch them in a minute to probably take off this stuff. And I'm probably going to do a little swatching for my TikTok and my um, Instagram. So, I, yeah, I got all six of them. This is the one I have on right now. This one is giving me life, y'all. Look at that beautiful color. These And look at the Lux packaging for Melody. Y'all know, okay. Milani ain't playing. Milani is not playing. Oh, my face. It's hot in here for some reason. I finally got the air conditioner in, and it's hot in here. Okay. Then I bought some new blushes that they have. This one is Cherry on Top, and this one is Peach of Me. Don't worry. We'll be swatching them soon. And I also got, they have, I've been off into this, glowy skin tint thing so now they have this glow tint hydrating skin tint so i got two of them i got um 210 light to medium and i got um 250 medium so i wasn't sure this light to medium might be too late but anyway wasn't sure so i picked those up 
Then they also gave me some Milani Rose hand sanitizer. This is so cute. I'm going to take that to work because I'm going to have some spray sanitizers at my desk. So, oops, sorry. So then I did a lot of Ulta shopping. So I'm going to show you a bunch of Ulta stuff as I go along. I got freebies because I got a whole box full of stuff that I just kind of threw together. Um, so one of the things was a freebie was either a backpack or a tote. So I got this backpack. Um, I'm actually not planning on keeping it. It's going to be part of the giveaway. So I'm going to put it back in this bag because um, I'm planning on making this a giveaway at Christmas time, which I'm going to fill up the bag. And then that's going to be the giveaway. So I did that. And I got all these freebies from Ulta recently. Like everything I, I was doing, freebies, freebies, freebies. So I got a lot of freebies. So this is the Tula Get Tone Pro Glycolic 10% Resurfacing Toner. This is a nice size sample. Oh, I like it. I think I'm going to do a skincare sample giveaway because I got a lot of skincare samples that I'm not planning on using. But anyway, this is Hyaluron Skin Essence. Ooh, I like a good essence. So I got that. This is Cosrx Snail 96 Snail Snow. Uh, this is the Snail Mucin Essence. I'm going to give this away mainly because I've already tried it and it broke me out. Now, I know a lot of people swear by this, but it just didn't do well on my skin. Then I've got Peach and Lily, who was my new love skincare brand. And this is their Wild Dew Treatment Essence. And I wanted to try this so fast. Yes. And then I've got ND Lee CLQ10 Toner Lotion. Huh. Interesting. It's a sprayer. Okay. So there's a lot of toners in here. <laughs> and um, it had a Thayer's Witch Hazel, but B's friend Chrissy, she's like my little girl, she wanted it. So I gave him this is proactive revitalizing toner. I don't really like proactive, so yeah, that's going to be, be given away. All right, so let me keep going. And I will say where I got things because they're kind of mixed up in this thing, so I don't know how it's going to work out. So I got this Estee Lauder Sheer Double Wear double wear sheer long wear makeup i have it on now been trying it out i'm not i'm the i'm not sure if i like it yet um we'll see we'll see i'm a little hot now so it might be the issue um this is vanilla company clean it zero three-in-one cleansing balm now i honestly live for my two which is the coke um, um I have two that I normally use, Pines and Palmers, coconut oil and a cleansing balm. But I wanted to try this out because I think I think it was a good price or something. I don't know why I bought it, but anyway, I did. So there we have it. Now, I got some other freebies from, uh, what's they called? Ulta. Because when I was purchasing, it was either lipstick day or I bought on diamond platinum day, which was beginning of August, but I'm rolling it all in too. Because it was like first or second. So they gave me Clinique. This has Happy in it. It has the um, Take the Day Off makeup remover and some. And this this is one of their um, mascaras. Um, I do like the Take the Day Off makeup remover, and that's kind of good to have if I'm traveling because it's just like really small. So I might keep that one. Anyway, then I got um, some. I wanted some mask, so I bought a bunch of masks. So I bought this one. I bought this Ulta Beauty Blueberries and Yogurt because it was so cute and little. And they had a, a, a good sale. So I got that. Then I got um, this. I've never used this before. Vitamin K. So I was trying new stuff. Resurfacing mask right here. So I got this. This is, uh, what company is this? Art Naturals Loves. So I wanted to try that. I looked at it. It seemed pretty nice. So I went with it. I also bought this. Um, which is butter oil free hyaluronic gel cream. I bought it because I thought it's a black on brand. I wanted to try something, you know, trying to support. Um, no, this is I will I talked about it during my makeup when I put the makeup on, but real quick, this is um too thick and too sticky for someone who wears makeup. This is not this is more I swear this is made by a man. It's a it's a black man who owns a company. And this is this would be a great moisturizer for a black man. For someone like me who wears makeup, no, because it makes your skin really sticky. It just feels like a, a, um, a film is over my skin. It doesn't just sink right in. It, it kind of lays on your skin. And that that's just, I'm just being honest, okay? 
just being honest um and then because of lipstick day i bought a bunch of stuff so they gave me this whole little list they gave me all these lip oils there's patrice there's the ulta beauty there's bare minerals lip gloss and balms so they gave me a bunch of freebies um i like i said the lip oils i'm sorry they just uh, they're just a overpriced um for real they're just an overpriced um lip lip smacker remember lip smackers back in the day the, the the ones we used to put on not lip smackers but the um ones which ones what they call but they were the juicy ones the roll on ones that's what they are this is lip comfort oil by clarence i haven't tried that one yet i mean i, I i'm not so impressed with them that i feel the need um to purchase them no now this they gave me that i love this is a lip scrubber it's a silicone lip scrubber right now i am old school i've always just put like vaseline and a little and used the old toothbrush to like exfoliate my my lips but this is actually kind of cute i will say this i think a toothbrush works a little better because it's a little more abrasive so it really does if you got dry skin, lips yeah it's gonna take it but for me it's kind of cute and then I found these and I'm trying them out. These are from Freeman. These were like $2.50, 50 cent. So this is a sleeping mask and mask and scrub. So you kind of just open it up and then you're supposed to get like about seven uses of them. We're going to see. Um, we'll see. Because then I thought about it, I said, that's not a good deal <laughs> at that price. Then I also received this for free. This is um, Milani. This is one of their lip glosses and this is in bare pink i'm pretty sure i have this so this is going to go into a giveaway and yeah this is the daily lip scrubber right here all right so there's that and then what else did they get me oh sugar they gave me a fresh lip treatment because you know ulta ulta now has fresh they ain't playing with sephora seth Fora. they like oh okay so we're gonna get out we're gonna snatch all your brands as soon as that contract is up we are snatching all of your brands and then i got this real techniques body brush and the reason why i got this is because and i'll show this now um i got this through my trend move box at the beginning of the month and this is this nabla skin body glow it's sugar babe and then i have one that i made and I was like, oh, I want one of them brushes I be seeing them with. But then I saw, you know, but then these companies, they be losing their damn mind. So they was wanting like $30 for that brush. Mm -mm. I found this Real Techniques brush, and it's really cute for all of $6.49 on sale. Thank you very much. So, yeah, I got this. I got to figure, let me, hold on. I got time. Let's do a little quick demo. So we're going to do this. And you know, because I've been watching everybody, and they just like, and they put it. So let's do it. Let's do it. Let's put it right here. So we're just gonna do a little bit, just a little bit. And you know, because I'm seeing them, and then they had a brush, and then they brushing it all around, and it just looks so luxurious and so beautiful. So let's try it. Did I put enough on me, so y'all can see. I don't think I did. Because I mean, they be spread, they be spread, spreading this shit on thick. So let's go. And the brush, the kabuki brush. You know, because I've been seeing everybody doing this. And it's just been looking so luxurious. Now, I did wear this while I was out of town. And uh, I got so many comments. They were like, oh my God, you're struggling so much. I was like, yes, I am. Ooh, I feel, I feel good, y'all. Okay, Lulu got to get, stop being so fluffy so she can have her collar bones back again so that we can really see it. Woo okay, oh, and it smells good too. So that was another thing I got this month. All right, now, new fragrances came out and yeah, I don't know what happened. So anyway, I bought these. I bought Goddess and Woman. I'm gonna try this out one more time. And then I bought Alien Goddess. Now, I know a lot of people, I say now a lot, <sighs> there's mixed reviews on this many people don't like it they say it's not like alien it doesn't have the alien dna and all that and i agree it's not super alienish but it's a beautiful floral it's a beautiful jasmine 
for the summertime people say a coconut no i don't get coconut i get the vanilla i get the bergamot so it's kind of like a citrusy bright um alien so it's like a summer alien to me no it is not vibing just like it. it's not as strong i will say i don't think it's as strong however for some reason i don't smell it but other people smell it on me so i lose it but i've actually got compliments on it but i'm not smelling it at that point so i don't know what that's about i don't know if it's coming off my clothes or what but anyway i like alien so i'm just here to say that oh th then i got this watermelon refresh um stick mask mud mastic i did a, a video years ago on a nut, the first a brand that has about i think it's olay i'll see if i can find it put it in the cards but yeah i did that one and and then i got um what a second oh and then i got this one this is grande lips hydrating lip plump brown you know what but we're gonna put this over here and finally i got the yerba mate wake up gel from ulta so this is all the stuff i got from ulta then I bought some fragrances. Let's just get them out the way. So I bought, oh, and then I got this one. This is a bug sum, and I don't have this color. This is Celeste. So I might play with this one. I might keep this one because it's kind of cute, y'all. It's kind of cute, kind of cute. Then I bought some fragrances. So you all know I've done a whole video on these. I have Anwen, Rose of Venus, and Edolin by um, Dream House of Curio. So those are those. So. Oh, there we go. Then I have got, then I got um, Atar's Queen of Sheba. I will be talking about this soon. Then I have, um, <laughs> then I have Tuberose, Boucheron's Tuberose's de Madras. It's a Tuberose. It's a good one. I mean, did I need it? Probably not, but I still love it. Okay, then, uh, oh, and then I got, um, so I got some freebies there. Oh, and then I got this other one. This is um, something they sent me. This is some NYX thing. I don't know what it is. I'm going to have to look it up. Okay, now I bought lipsticks. More lipsticks. So here are the lipsticks that I bought. I actually have more lipsticks, too. I forgot about those. So I have these. I got Huda Beauty. So I'm just going to show you the boxes. So I got Game Night because they kind of vibe with the color that's inside. So I have Game Night. I have, so I bought four because they would buy one, get one free. I have Ladies Night. I have, I got uh, Promotion Day. I think this is my red because I bought a red. And then I got um, Interview. So I got this one. Then I bought some Natasha Denona's. Natasha, I don't know if I'm back on her site again because she irritated me with the way she does things. Because you don't get free shipping until over $50 and they mean 50 on one. So it was buy one, get one free. And two of them were, you know, like $25 a piece. So I bought four, 50. I was going to have to pay shipping. And they were talking about $25 shipping. So I wound up buying two more, six, two more because that was the same fucking price. So anyway, I have Allison right here. I have Noah right there. I have Claudia. I have Ly Liron or something. Um, I really like that one too. And then I have Naya. And I have Avril. And I think this one is gorgeous. So those are the nudes I bought. So yeah, that's that. Then I purchased Sydney Grace. Sydney uh, Grace was having her um, Christmas in July, and I bought three mystery bags. So I bought two and got one for free. <laughs> so I bought the purple one, the the taupe one, and the green one, and these are the deep ones. But she had them in different color schemes, light and deep. So I got those. So what I did was I put everything in one right didn't i oh yeah, yeah these are the ones i got the wrong okay so let me show you what i got now the, i'm gonna show you one thing and then i'm gonna show you this so i i thought i asked for all shadows only but okay i got some other things i'm missing something i think matter of fact i know i am hold on 
Okay, so here are the things I got. I got um, in the mystery bags. I got, um, I consolidated everything. So this is some loose pigment. This is in, it's very beautiful. Um, it's in comforting lights. I'm not a huge loose pigment person, so I might be giving this away because I, I don't really use loose pigment. So it's no point in me keeping it if I'm really not going to use it. Um, and then I got, oh, now this is what I, I actually was going to order this separately. So it worked out really well. So I love her cream shadows. So I was able to get um, this one in cranberry streusel. There's a color. I had wanted that color. And then she said um, two liquid lipsticks. I'm actually going to put these in a giveaway because I'm not going to use them. So I'm going to put those in a, in a giveaway. And then I got three highlighters three highlighters I forget the names of them I'm not gonna open them all the way up but I got three highlighters and I got that one and then I got that one and then this is the extra one that I had so I'm gonna show you the uh, the shadows I got and then yeah so these are all my extras so that was my extra one so that's gonna go into a giveaway boom okay so now of course you get some you know, I got some single shadows, the Sydney Grace. So here are the ones that I got during the sale. This section right here, because it's two, four, five. I bought the Tentalia one, but all of the rest of them were um, new shadows for me um, for, you know, to work on my palette. I, do, I am planning on getting some smaller palettes to, uh, so I can like play with them because I want to start doing some stuff with my single shadows. But anyway, yeah, I had this um, and it was good because I only got one duplicate and it was a duplicate of something that they sent me. So it wasn't like I got any duplicates of the stuff I already had, which was a winner winner chicken dinner. Um, so, yeah, that's my Sydney Grace. Then I also got this. I don't know how this happened. This is like one of one off things that I just bought. This is Laura Geller's Urban Garden Face, Eye, and Cheek Palettes. I'm going to show them to you because they're so awesome. Um, I kind of like this. I have another set of these that from years ago. Now, I will say this. I really like the packaging on this. Oh, I hate when I can't get it open because it's like that soft touch and even the box is soft touch. It's really beautiful, quite beautiful. Um, but anyway, these are the herb. These are face, eye, and cheek palettes. And these are so awesome to travel with. I'm really trying to minimize, especially like not now, I'm not going to be doing a whole lot of traveling, but I'm really anticipating like saying going on like to a Caribbean island or something, you know, doing some really cool stuff in the next few years. Not right now. Um, but anyway, I love these because they're, you know, they're just that. You just got them and you have enough. So this is a face, eye, and cheek palette. Three different ones. They come in a set. They were like $39, but I got 20% off with shipping and everything and went back up to $39. So it was, it was a win. Um, but anyway, this is Flower District. So I love them. Look at that. Look at how pretty that is. Um, and then this is the Highline. So they always give you a blush and a highlighter and for shadows and then this is um no this is the one i just showed you and then this is central park so that's central park so boom yay so there we go so that's that's those right there i forgot to show y'all this and i am in love with it i'm wearing it right now this is huda beauty's glowish bronzer in tan light o m g i am so glad i got this look at how beautiful that is oh my goodness so i got that and then when I was out of town, um, I did do a little cosmetic company shopping. Don't ask me why. I needed lashes, so I bought some lashes. I ain't even gonna try to find the lashes, but I got lashes. And then I got this. I got so much stuff on this damn desk. I gotta clear it all off as soon as I'm done. This is Bobbi Brown. This is foil petal right here. This is a highlighter. I'm a highlighter, I'm wearing it right now. Yes, baby, yes. Then I bought some powder kiss lipsticks yes i really do love the powder kisses so i bought three i bought a set of three it was like i want to say 15 dollars or something like that but anyway this is one of them this is uh work 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 this is shocking revelation i didn't even know what colors i was getting but i really do like the powder kiss um formulation 
It's a beautiful comfort mat. And then I got mullet over, which is this one over here. So just really pretty, you know, beautiful colors, shades, whatever you want to call it. Um, and so I'm going to show one more thing. After that, I'm not showing anything else because I'm trying to stay within our time frame. And if you didn't know, of course, I picked up um, this Kate Spade bag, tote bag. Um, while I was out, so I got this nice, cute Kate Spade tote bag. Oh, but something else is in here. And then I'm about to use uh, cute little Cole Haan sandals. Really cute, very comfortable. Yeah, just doing the damn thing as best I can. As best I can, you know. I'm just trying. Okay, so that is it for my Viva High Buy. And I'm not even going to lie, y'all. There's more to it. Um, but uh, this is all I can show you in the time allotted. I'm not showing. Oh, this is one of the tops I bought, though, for while I was out of town. I didn't even take it, but I kind of like it now. And next time, I'm going to be rocking this. It's going to be so cute, though. But anyway, anyway, anyhow, anywho, thank you for watching hanging out with me and Coco. Y'all know we 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 buy some stuff. There's a lot of clothes I didn't show y'all and some more shoes and a purse. Okay, but anyway, there's some I've done the halls during July, so you probably you could just look them over. Okay, just look them over. All right, see you later.